how's it going? So welcome to Artistic Intentions Studios. Um, so this is part two on this painting uh, that I totally boogered up with this glitter. Um, I was using a different resin and I've used it before but yeah. <laughs> It really cured quickly. It's already dry, and I just poured it this morning. Um, and it was looking okay. It had some cool stuff going on, and then I poured this glitter, hoping to incorporate it more. But it, yeah. Anyway, so um, I have stone coat countertop resin now, and so I know I have better working time and. And all of that. So I'm just going to attempt to go over this with, I put some alcohol ink, purple, in, in some resin here. And this is what I should have done the first time, just kind of lightly sprinkled some of the bronze glitter in, instead of making it such a thick um, application of glitter. But anywho, I am going to attempt to cover this, this um, should make it somewhat translucent. I put probably about 10 drops of alcohol ink in this purple. Um, So I'm hoping that it will kind of show through, but also kind of cover what I hate. <laughs> so we are going to just pour it on here and then I'm going to use, my goodness having issues here. I'm going to use this heat gun to kind of warm it up and push it around a bit. Once I get this, mm. nice and covered, then I'm going to go in with the glitter on top of it. Hoping this does the trick. I did lightly sand this first coat and then I, I wiped it down with a soft cloth and alcohol just because it's two different kinds of resin and I don't know exactly, you know, I'm hoping. I'm hoping it'll adhere just fine. I don't know if this is worth saving. If I don't like this, then I probably won't waste any more resin on it. But sometimes we get happy little accidents. Sometimes we just get lessons. <laughs> And part of me doesn't even want to post these videos, but then part of me is like, well, you know, maybe it's good to see the, the mistakes as well as the uh, victories. So... That's kind of cool. I mean, I can maybe work with that. And 
I'm hoping this light coat of glitter will just kind of distract from these strong lines of glitter underneath. Who knows? Just going to spread it around a bit. See what happens. Might it end up being an okay background for something or I just don't know. But it is definitely um, easier to work with this resin. Yeah, there you have it. Just another coat and we'll, we'll see how this dries and see if I can come up with anything to do with it to make it worth worth continuing with. Um, I think I'll use a torch to pop any air bubbles very important with resin that you do pop the bubbles because you don't want them to dry the bubbles. I think that's uh, workable. Might be able to do something on top of that. So let me pause you. I'll bring you in for a close up and show you what I'm dealing with here. Hang on a second, guys. Okay, we're back. I'm having some technical difficulties with this phone of mine. But anyway, the um, the purple. It's still translucent. You can still see some of the fun stuff going on underneath. And um, you can still see those lines. Pretty heavy. Still not a huge fan. I don't know. But the purple does kind of fade it a bit. And then there's just the sparkle all over from the um, from the glitter that I that I put in the clear resin so I don't know <laughs> who knows I may scrap the whole thing but that's what it looks like you can see underneath that I was getting some cool effects and then the purple on top I mean that doesn't look too bad I just really I'm still not a fan of these lines of glitter that I was not able to disperse. They just, they, it cured way too quickly. So, anywho, that's that. Still questioning it. It kind of looks, I don't know. There's some night sky going on in there, but I don't know. I'll have to think about that. Shoot me some comments. Let me know what you think. Should I scrap it or should I continue to build on it and try to make something of it? I don't really know. It might be an okay background for something. Let me know in the comments what you think. So, I hope you're having a great day. Sorry for the air traffic. <laughs> Airplane going over. Anywho, have a great day. Come back and see me again soon. Till next time, guys.